If God says no to graven images, and Jesus at one time was annoyed when people put graven images in the place of prayer, what is the significance of the graven images in the Catholic Church as they are told it is a tribute to honor the holy people? Is it right, really, to keep these in church? And who brought the idea of statues into the Catholic Church? Is it right to worship in the same place where these images are? In John chapter 4, Jesus calls us to worship God in spirit and in truth. We do not worship images of God. We don't worship images of Jesus. We worship God directly. We worship Jesus Christ. It's fascinating how all of us have to worship. To worship means to consider ultimately worthy. So Jesus Christ calls us to consider him ultimately worthy and to worship him, to adore him, to stand in awe of him, to love him, to praise him to give our lives to him. I do not know exactly how the tradition of graven images started in the Catholic Church, but I don't have a humongous problem with them. I have many friends who are devout Catholics who really do worship Jesus, and yet there are images of different saints in the church. There are images of Christ in the church. I don't have some humongous problem with that until I observe a person beginning to put too much significance in a physical statue. That is unfortunate, for Jesus calls us to worship him in spirit and in truth. And the vast majority of my Catholic friends worship Jesus. They don't actually worship a statue.